May Elohim bless you guys. Today is October 1st of 2022. I have another important message that I need to share with all of you. The title of this message is Hold On To Your Crown. Once again, to the Father be the glory and the honor forevermore. May his name be praised. Amen. Here is the message. Hold on to your crown. Many are in the valley of decision. Be grounded in Jesus now. Strong deceptions, illusions is approaching as it peaks. Stay in Jesus. Be founded in Jesus. Keep your eyes on Jesus. The world is preparing to deceive many more. I saw in a dream how they became to express trust us terrestrial more and more. Through television and through people that have been deceived, trying to brainwash many and believing their storyline like actors acting a scene in a play, showing what man calls and understands it as aliens. I saw a gathering place, a church, that the pastor in this church was selling wedding gowns to evil people that looked human, but that I perceived them as not human. I saw movements of money between the pastor and them. Hold on to your crown. Hold on to the truth and sell it not. Hold on to the truth. Jesus is the way, the life, and the truth. I saw in a room many tables stationed and people stationed at these tables to give information they wanted the people to know. These people working at these stations were deceived believing in aliens, not realizing that these creatures are actually demons. Beloved people of God, hold on to your crown. Stay close to Jesus, for we are at the end of the finish race. People of God, many deceptions are coming. Don't believe what you see with your eyes. More deception is coming. Do not believe what you see with your eyes. Follow Jesus. Let his word be your guide. Let Jesus' word be your guide. His spirit and his children. Changes are coming. Many changes are coming. And the people of God must be ready and prepared. Listen. Listen. All those that have ears to listen. Many are in the valley of decision. If you are not founded upon the rock who is Jesus, if you are not in Jesus, you will not stand. For only in Jesus can we stand. Only in Jesus can we be victorious. Only in Jesus can we do all things. For it is not through our strength, for we have none, but it is in Jesus, Jesus in us, that gives us the strength. Change is coming. Changes is coming upon this world. Changes is coming. Be you ready now, for the time is at hand. Terrible time is coming upon this world. Like a woman in travail, terrible time is coming. Before she goes into labor, she will give birth. Who has heard such a thing or seen such a thing? but she will give birth to a man-child. The time is at hand. Who do you serve? For many are in the valley of decision.